Hey, welcome Lakers Angels fan radio. We definitely have a bias here. And Angels and White Sox played again. Uh, this was a great game, honestly. Um, the first game of the series, the Angels had all the hype. Second game, the White Sox had all the hype. And now it's finally kind of like even. Because the opening, you know, series is always crazy for every team. But things are kind of settling down. Uh, Angels were actually down um, by at least two at one point. And uh, Justin Upton hit a huge two-run home run that gave us the lead in the eighth inning, actually, bottom of the eighth, uh, when we were down. And uh, Jared Walsh hit a huge triple. This was a great game overall for the Angels. Um, Our bullpen is great. Our starting pitching was great. Let's go through the stats. Uh, The Angels won, so let's start with them. Fletcher uh, hit a run, two hits. He has some, uh, he's been hitting a lot better now. Um, the first two games weren't that great, I think, but he looks to be kind of in his groove. Um, he also scored <laughs> on a pop-up that the White Sox dropped. Um, that's where you see that run. We'll talk about that later. Otani DH'd, uh, he did get a hit. He had a single. Um, he's not been hitting that great. It's only the third game. But I I guarantee you, this will be a lot better in the coming weeks. And he's pitching tomorrow, by the way. So, yeah, we'll talk about that. Trout, he had three strikeouts. Didn't look good. Um, But whenever Trout does this, he (laughs) he always rebounds better. It's amazing. Like, he'll probably, he'll end up winning MVP. Rendon, uh, he had two runs and a hit. He had a pretty good game. Um, He got that... A single, I don't remember when it was, um, but anyway, it was a good looking swing. Rendon is probably the best hitter in the league when it regards to like seeing the ball on the strike zone, in my opinion. So, uh, if he can get a swing going, hit him hitting behind Trout is so deadly. Walsh had a run, two hits, two RBIs, he had the triple. Uh, he's gonna replace Pujols every day so he's got to be good and I'm really liking what I'm seeing from him I'm really liked what I saw from last year he was hitting the ball so well last year and this year so far so let's keep it going and then Upton player of the game run hit two RBIs it was that two run home run I mentioned Uh, we tied it up uh, yeah, we tied it up at three. Then he were a two-run home run, and uh, yeah, that was that changed the game because the White Sox were ahead and looked like, they looked like they were gonna close it out. But good job, Upton got the first of the year finally, and hopefully you can continue this. Iglesias, uh, he had a hit. Um, he's not been hitting that well, but his fielding has been amazing. Like, I know Simmons was a gold glover, but Iglesias is doing just fine for us. Suzuki finally got his first start. He did get a hit, uh, but that's it. He's not really a hitter, so can't really expect much out of him, to be honest. Fowler uh, didn't do anything. I'd probably bat Suzuki 9, to be honest, but whatever. Um, yeah, so five runs uh, for the Angels, nine hits, and... Uh, Trout and Otani uh, didn't really do much, but it's okay because we got guys like Walsh and Upton who can come through. So good job for those guys. White Sox, Anderson, um, he had a hit. Uh, that was about it. He's a really good player. Like he's gonna, this average is gonna go up. He's gonna do just fine if you're a White Sox fan. Uh, Eaton had two hits. He's looking pretty good this year. So far, you know, Abreu uh, didn't do anything. However, he's still the defending MVP, and every time he comes to the bat, I get nervous. Um, Yeah, he'll be just fine. Moncada, he had a run. Uh, Collins, he had a hit and a run. Um, He he didn't look too bad. Excuse me. Mercedes, yeah, okay, so here we go. Mercedes started out 
8 for 8 <laughs> within two games. We finally got him out for the first time ever. And when we got him out, we actually gave him our pitcher a standing ovation. So I thought that was hilarious. Because this guy, I mean, the hottest hitter I've ever seen. Uh, Luis Robert, he had two hits and an RBI. However, um, I forget when it was. It was early in the game. Very early. We had a pop-up. We had a runner on first or second. It was two outs, so the, the inning was going to be over, right? It was a pop-out to center field. Anderson had it, um, but then all of a sudden, Robert called him off for some reason, and then he completely dropped it, and then Fletcher scored, which tied it at one, I believe. So, Robert, it's a good player, but I don't know what the heck happened to him tonight. He literally, like, missed the ball, hit his right, hit him right in the head um, when Anderson had it. I don't know why he called Anderson off, but it doesn't matter. We got to run out of it, so I don't care. Pitching-wise, El Garcia... And Vaughn didn't do anything. But pitching-wise, Cobb, I was very impressed. He did go six innings. Um, he did give up eight hits and three runs. One of them was a home run. However, overall, like, he really pitched well. Um, you know, I think Cobb giving up three runs is pretty good. <laughs> I don't think we expect him to be an ace or anything. So Watson came in. I think he did very well. Um, I don't even know where he came from. I don't remember signing him or anything. And I've been following the Angels this whole time. So I don't know where he came from. All of a sudden, he was on our team and did well. So I ain't complaining about that. Junior Guerra came in. I thought he'd pitched well as well. He did pitch good in spring. And he got the win. So Guerra is looking solid for our bullpen. Iglesias didn't pitch because he pitched the last two games. Otherwise, he would have closed it out, probably. Lance Lynn always does good against the Angels. And I, when he was pitching tonight, he looked pretty good. I'm not going to lie. Uh, 4.2 innings, 6 hits, 2 runs. None of them earned, though. He's He always just does good against us. Same with Dallas Keuchel. Um, so the, the fact that we won this game... And by the way, we didn't like start doing good until Lance Lynn came out, I believe. So, you know, it was the bullpen of the White Sox that basically let us win, I think. Because Marshall came in and gave up three runs here. Lance Lynn was dealing, in my opinion. I, I probably would have kept him in longer than 4.2 innings. But, uh, yeah, Marshall got the loss. Garrett got the win. And it is a four-game series, so we play the finale tomorrow. Um, hopefully we win because we'll we'll win three out of four. You don't want to split a series. <laughs> you don't want to go two and two. Cause it's like what the heck was the point of that? But um, I'm gonna call that Trout hits his first home run tomorrow. And uh, yeah, I hope I'm right. <laughs> Cause he had three strikeouts tonight. It didn't look good, but you know this Angels lineup is so scary. And. Uh, we have Otani pitching tomorrow. He's going to start and hit. And we haven't seen that in a while. So I'm definitely going to be watching, and I hope that he does well because we kind of need him to do well. We cannot afford to have Otani do as bad as he did last year. Pitching and hitting. Yeah, so as long as he, you know, is at least average, we just need him to go five, six innings. Even if he gives up a few runs, it's fine. Just give us innings. We don't want to use our bullpen like we did last year. Every day. So, I'm excited. However, Otani has not been that consistent. So, if he comes out and just deals, he doesn't even need to do well hitting. As long as he pitches fine, like... I think team, people would really start to take the Angels more seriously if Otani pitches like an ace. Um, but it'd be interesting. I'm I'm sure everybody's gonna be watching tomorrow, and uh, I just hope he does well because we need him to. You know, we can't just only rely on our offense. It didn't work last year, so so good game, fantastic game from innings one to nine. And we'll see the finale tomorrow. Hopefully the Angels close it out.
start off three and one. But the Sox are good, so I don't know who's pitching tomorrow for the Sox, but uh Yeah, should be fun. Thanks for watching guys. And again, trout tomorrow home run. Until next time. Peace.